French lawmaker Nathalie Goulet is a member of the French Senate representing the Orne Department. She joins us on the phone from Vrigny in northeastern France. Thank you very much for joining us today. What's been your reaction? What are your thoughts following this latest tragic terrorist incident in France? Well, you know, it looks like a, a, a terrible rehearsal, you know, after Bataclan, Charlie, Brussels attack. I mean, it looks like it will never finish. It's a, it's a, it's a nightmare. And, you know, um, I, I, I was just listening, you know, whatever is the state of emergency, whatever are the watch lists, whatever is the work of our intelligence service, we, we are just unable to prevent this kind of drama. And, and it's a fact. As you say, it's like a nightmare that never finishes, but the facts are this is the seventh terrorist attack, three major ones, four minor ones in France since January 2015. When it comes to lone wolf incidents, how can France protect itself? Well, for example, I don't believe at all in a loaf, a, a, a lonely wolf. I mean, that's, that's it. We know, you know, they are acting by themselves, but it doesn't mean that they are not connected with other people. So, um, you know, I, I'm, I led an um, uh, investigation committee on the jihadists two years ago, and we had a, a lot of preconization, but at the same time, our conclusion was that um, we, we, we cannot um, uh, establish any uh, lonely wolf um, strategy, in fact. Even they are acting by themselves, as I told you, uh, they are connected. And uh, that is a fact. And probably we will find some connection with those people, the, the guy from today or from yesterday, uh, with other people. But, you know, he was not on the watch list. And even he would have been on the watch list. Doesn't that mean that we, we would have stopped it? That is the point. You know, we have a lot of people on the watch list, like Mera, Koulibaly, Kwashi, the people from Bataclan were on the watch list, the people from Charlie were on the watch list, and we were unable to stop them. That so what can, be do what can be done then when the French population today is in mourning, you know, for the third major time since January last year, and they're looking for answers, what are you going to say? Uh, I'm afraid we do not have any uh, uh, answer, and I, I don't think that more criminalization will help. We are under an heavy state of emergency, and see what happened. Um, nice is a, is a b b very, um, um, it, it's a city where the mayor and the local power um, are very involved in security. They have a, a military, I mean, a, a, a municipal police. They have um, facial recognition with camera in the street. Uh, they have a, a very firm policy. And despite all those things, uh, this crazy truck can run in the promenade des Anglais and kill uh, 84 people. Uh, I think we have to review all the things, but I think that the, the people have to get used to live with this terrorism uh, feeling and, uh, and acting.